Let us recap that breaking news on Bank of America broke just moments ago, and it has to do with an agreement that Bank of America has reached with the so-called GSEs, Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac. It all has to do with what are known as putbacks. Uh, Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac demanding that Bank of America repurchase mortgages because of allegations of faulty underwriting, missing documentation and the like. Uh, Bank of America says that it has reached an agreement with Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac concerning putbacks uh, of residential mortgages. These are mortgages that Bank of America sold to Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac. And to a certain degree, and this might explain the, the slight increase in Bank of America's stock this morning, it caps Bank of America's liability on that front. But as the bank points out in its press release, it does not address servicing obligations. And so while the cap does, uh, let's say, contain Bank of America's exposure on one exposure rally, uh, rather on one level, it doesn't contain it entirely. And further to that $3 billion of provisions that Bank of America is taking as a result of this agreement, the company says it is going to take a non-cash, non-tax non deductible charge of $2 billion for goodwill impairment. This is all going to be recorded in Bank of America's fourth quarter results, which will be reported over the next three weeks.